A 60-year-old male client had a hernia repair in an outpatient surgery clinic. He is awake and alert, but has not been able to voice since he returned from surgery six hours ago. He received 1,000 ml of IV fluid, which action would be most likely to help him avoid. Have him drink several glasses of water, A or B, perform credits method on the bladder from the bottom to the top, or C, a system to stand by the side of the bed to void, or D, wait two hours and have him try to void again. Okay, so why do you say that it looks like B? What's your rationale behind it? Because all the three um, options is like, they don't make sense. Uh, I have the clients who drink se several um, glasses of water. These patients already um, receive IV and the, this patient cannot void. Um, start making him stand by the side of the bed to void, it doesn't make sense. And to wait for two hours for him to void again, all doesn't make sense. So I thought to, to perform the crest method is the only oh. one that. Here is where I said, when you see answer choices, to give each of them a fear. I know you say it doesn't look good or it doesn't make sense, but kind of rationalize it out. If you give him a drink of several glasses of water, will that help? No. So well, he received 1000 ml already. So, yeah. you know, it won't help. Okay. Perform the creep method on the, on the bladder from the bottom to the top. Okay. You can say you can press on the bladder so that the urine can come out. Alrighty, that could be an option. Assist him to stand by the bedside to void. Why would I assist him to stand? Well, he's a male. He's not used to laying down to urinate. So put him in the standing position can more facilitate that. Alrighty. Two, Sorry, D, wait two hours and have him try to void again. Nah, he hasn't void for, for um, six hours, so he won't wait two hours again. So the two answer choices there that you're looking at is B and C. So you can either press his abdomen to let him urinate, or you can have him stand up at the side of the bed to void. Which one would you do? Hold on, I just realized something. The patient had a hernia repair. Are we allowed to even palpate that area? Good question. I, good question. Good question. Uh, no, no, no. Good question. I just realized that. Okay. Good question. So, what's your answer? Oh, shoot. I think it might be C. It's just possibility. If I'm wrong, I'm wrong. It's okay. But, oh, wow. Yeah. So, because he's a male, he feels better at standing up urinating. Not only that, that's, that is the most feasible position for a male to urinate. In addition to that gravity and something against the create um, method too is the herniated repair. So massaging the abdomen or pressing the abdomen will make it a little bit difficult for even doing that because you don't want anything to dehiss. So when a male is not able to use a urinal on assist, the client should stand by the side of the bed to void. This is a most desirable position for a normal voiding male client. Also, given his age, he's most likely to some degree of having a prostate enlargement, which may interfere with voiding. 